Hello? Okay, this is going to be another audio test. Uh, what's going to happen is I'm going to be watching on my phone a performance from Robin Williams. To be specific, it's his speech when he kicked off the AFI Life Achievement Awards tribute to Al Pacino. Uh, what's going to happen is I'm going to be looking at his monologue and trying to speak the monologue as best as I can. And then hopefully through some editing here, you will also hear the audio will also be placed in this video. So you'll hear the audio, original audio and my interactions. So that being said, here we go. Okay, I got a series of ads here. And pressing play now. Ladies and gentlemen, Robin Williams. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Bienvenido. Welcome to the 35th annual AFI Life Achievement Award, a tribute to Al Pacino. The man sitting at that table there, the table that looks like the Last Supper stage by Armani. <laughs> this is an award that couldn't be more deserved. Think about it. At the very beginning of Al's career, he made the following movies in a span of five years. Are you ready? Five years. He made The Godfather, Serpico, Godfather II, Dog Day Afternoon. Yes, indeed. We could have given you this award in 1975, but that'd be a little early. It would be like Macaulay Culkin getting a Gene Hirschfeld Award, not good. But Al's career has endured over 40 years. So many great films, so many great performances. The Academy Award for Godfather II, the Academy Award for Raging Bull. Wait a minute. I am out of rehab, but that's wrong. That's Robert De Niro. But if you put Robert De Niro in a dryer, you get Al Pacino. You get that downside version. That's what you have right there. And tonight is about the work. And one measure of a man's work is a number of classic movie quotes he has recorded in the history books. For example, in the movie Insomnia, Al said to my character, you're about as mysterious to me as a block toilet is to a f***ing plumber. Thank you, Mr. Shakespeare. <laughs> also, you had, say hello to my little friend. A line, yes. A line heard in bedrooms all around the world. Sad, but true. A lot of people think Scarface was a little over the top, but anybody, anybody who's ever done a pound of Peruvian blow knows that is a documentary. Yes, indeed. Yeah, baby. You got Donnie Brasco, forget about it. You got Injustice for All, the present administration going, I'm out of order, you're out of order. And then, what about hoo-ha? What are you, foghorn leghorn? What's that? Hoo-ha! That's not even a phrase. It's a noise you make when you're getting a rectal exam. Hoo-ha! One of the noise, the most annoying catchphrases of all time, and yet you got an Oscar for it. Forget that. <laughs> but there's one quote that has echoed across all time. I want you all to do it with me. This is the one that really kind of struck a chord. I want you to do it with me. Attica! 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 Come on, everybody! Attica! 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 Playboy bunnies! Playboy bunnies! Okay, let me explain what we're doing. Attica was a prison, and there were a lot of guys who were pissed off, and Hef will tell you later once the Viagra wears off. <laughs> but enough about me. We are here for you tonight, you singular special talent. We're all here. We're older, wiser. Some of us stripped of our vices. You know who you are. I'd like to raise a glass to you, but that'd be 11 months out the window. 
Here we go. For this night. God bless you, Jamie, brother, please. I'm so happy Jamie Foxx is in the house. Yes, indeed. Because your work has stood the test of time. Because you've stood the test of time. And we stand with you to say congratulations on receiving the AFI Life Achievement Award. Let's all raise our glass to Alfredo James Pacino. Or as many of us know you, Al Pacino. For you, Godfather. 